Hello y'all, p 6 here with a brand new demo disc yet again. This time, another request, as you may know. This time it's Euro Demo 69. And this was requested by the Awesome Pandas LP, and also I want to dedicate this disc to Digital Masterpieces. You all know his issue with, you know, number 69 and shit. So, yeah. <coughs> Euro Demo 69. Um, yeah. Nothing really special about the interface, it kind of looks like some of the other ones we've seen before, but it looks a little bit stripped down, so it looks more simplistic, I guess, if you know what I mean. Um, so, shall we check this disc out? We have, first things first, Batman of the Future, Muppet Monster Adventure, The Emperor's New Groove, Army Man Sarge's Hero, Army Man Air Attack, ISS Pro 2, C12 Final Resistance, Ready to Rumble 2, Burst, Burstrick, Burstrick, no idea, um, and yeah, that's about it, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, alright, 9, also, let's, uh, well, there, there is something really special about this disc, if you don't know, well, you will see eventually, if you do know, you know what I'm referring to, alright, but, uh, let's just go, Batman of the Future. Alright, so, uh, yeah, a new Batman game was released quite recently, um, Arkham Origins. I probably won't get that. I bought Arkham Asylum and Arkham City, and I enjoy both games. They're really good. But, uh, Arkham Origins, nah, no. I'm not more much for these kind of prequels, you know. There are some exceptions, of course. I mean, my favorite game in... My favorite game in the Metal Gear Solid series is is uh, Metal Gear Solid 3, and that's a prequel, so, you know, it depends on the game. I mean, it just feels kind of lazy, I mean, Orcam Origins, really? That's pretty generic, don't you think? Oh, yeah, right, Batman of the Future, Return of, Return of the Joker, yeah, story mode. You are... Batman. Okay, uh, I'll press X at story mode, and it goes back to push. To oh, I was supposed to use circle to. Uh, circle to uh, act as X, you know. <laughs> what exit X button? Wait, display bat suit selection screen. Select. Punch, it's all in the mind. Jump, use gadget. Defense, crouch, run, walk, select gadgets. Default, start button. Okay. Stage 1, air and space, R&D. Hopefully this will be quite easy on you if, since it is the first stage and all. What is going on now? Okay, there's no voice actors, it seems like. Maybe there were, I couldn't even hear anything. <coughs> Buddha! Stay back! Grr! We're jokers, pal! What? Ah, screw it. Oh, fuck all the text. I don't... I don't feel like reading that. Okay, so... Great range I have here. You found a key, okay, to uh, what? I mean, this is one of those, like, side scroller brawlers kind of games, you know, like Streets of Rage. Kind of like that Asterix game I played on the last demo. I mean, 
I'm not really a big fan of that, especially like PS PlayStation 1. I mean, PlayStation had a lot more technical capabilities than this crap. So why did they go make a game like you could play on like Nintendo 8-bit? I don't get that. How do I open the door? Okay, did that? Yeah, that opened it. Okay, cool. I pressed triangle and it did something. I thought this gun was gonna be more, uh, you know, uh, more open. Not just a side scroll, of, you know, brawler like this. With a very basic attack input as well. I mean, two buttons, one punches and one kicks, and doesn't seem to be any combos, as far as I know. I don't care. That makes it really easy to play, so. Just kick him in the ass like that, and. You know, it's uh, it's all good. That's all I'm gonna do. I'm gonna mash X. Because, you know, it's uh, easy to do. As you see. They're just walking into it. How fun is that, huh? There's no tech there's no technique to it at all. It's just mash X and you're good. He hurt me some there though, but screw it. Hopefully there'll be a, like a power up or a refill somewhere. That would be cool. What the hell? What's up with his range? Come on. Boy. Thank you. Ooh, yeah, there we go. With 10, that's lame. We triangle and square does the exact same thing. Whoa, can't even see that thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, that was uh, beautiful. In here, perhaps. Blah 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 blah. I don't care. All right. Where do I have to like make these fancy? Um Am I fighting this dude or something? Is it right? Can I just stand here and do this then? No. Okay. What that was gonna work? Uh ooh. That didn't hit me. Oh, lame. Continue, sure. Well, right back into it. Oh, that's pretty generous. Oh, that didn't hit him? Oh, lame. What? Why does it free? What the fuck? Come on. That the, how am I? That didn't hit either. You're kidding me? Oh wait. And now that. Huh. Whoa. That. Now it. Oh, what the fuck was that? That was some A grade bullshit right there. That didn't. How? What? It, it worked before. Now. What the hell is this? Why 
Why does it freeze like all of a sudden? Ooh. Oh. Oh, come on now. Okay, uh, let's do this for real, sis. This is the first level in the game, and I'm failing. Well, uh, this is bullshit, I tell you what. That's right. I really want to kill this dude. Or oh, Batman never kills anyone, you know. But, uh... Well, if that didn't kill him, then I don't know what the hell happened. Wow, coming soon. Yeah, I really want to get that game. Don't y'all? Um, no. Uh, I don't think so. Okay, that sucked. Major. It was really bad. Horrible. Horrible. Right, so screw it, we're done with that one at least, that's good. So, we'll move on to Muppet Monster Adventure. Sounds pretty lame, I guess. One will never know. Until they play it, of course, but uh, that's what we're here to do, right? Yeah. Hey. Can't forget about that, huh? You. Yeah. That's the main reason. Uh, Psygnosis. Oh no, Magenta Software. Seen that before, and... Did not indicate quality, I tell you what. Damn, I'm actually gonna start recording my Star Fox Adventures LP today. That's gonna be sweet. I'm gonna need to disconnect my PS3 from the Elgato game capture there. And I will not have it plugged into the Elgato for uh, about four weeks or something. Yeet. That's pretty cool. I will still be plugged in because I need to finish like Mass Effect 2, Bad Company 2, uh, Call of Duty Ghosts. I don't know if I finished Peacock Purgatory. Whoa. Graphical glitches. I mean, I pre ordered Call of Duty Ghosts and I received it on release date, I assume. Whoa, spin attack. Crash Bane. L1 and R1 is camera, R2 runs. No, L1, R1 runs. L1 doesn't. Oh, this displays your current uh, progress, I guess. X jumps. Graphical glitches. Whoa. No, oh, okay, there we go. Triangle, that's nothing. Circle spins, square does this. What that does, I have no idea. Hola, as promised. I, Pepe, will be on the air to help you rescue Kerman and the rest of our friends. When you Kerman? see my receiver, come up and hear what I have to say. Who is Kerman? I thought it was called Kermit. What's going on with the glitches and the graphics here? That's pretty damn annoying. I think you all can agree on that, right? Ah, oh, screw it. <coughs> Okay. Oh, I thought I needed a key to open that. Never mind then. Just my spiral logic that told me that, but never mind. I wonder what these stars do. I have no idea. Probably kind of pointless to collect them all since, you know, it's a demo and nothing's gonna save. Uh, can we get enough of that? It seems to happen when you go into like corners or something. That graphical glitches, I mean. That's pretty lame. So, uh... Okay. Oh, oh, I got an N from bonus. Or N bonus. What, the last one exploded. There we go. Alright. Oh, is that a one-up or something? I don't know. <clears throat> One can only guess. No double jump. <coughs> oh, sis. Sorry, I had to clear my throat. I don't know what's going on. Yo. Oh, he died? Okay. Where's the B in yo? Oh, oh. <coughs> B and yo. B and O. I don't know. 
Oh, did that fly restore my health or something? What? It's on a time limit, apparently. Alright. Whoa. Whoa. Alright, no, um, yeah. It was on a time limit, it's pretty lame. Alright, um, uh, let's move on to Emperor's new groove. And guess what? You'll see. You'll see. I know what's gonna happen. I read about this. You see, it can indicate by the quality that it's gonna be a video. Organaut? Really? Whoa. I didn't know that. They made croc. <clears throat> Maybe this game is quite... Maybe it's decent. I don't know. I mean, it's not like croc are great games. I mean, I enjoyed them when I was younger, but... They're not that fun nowadays. It's just annoying to play. I haven't actually seen the movie either. Maybe I should. <laughs> I don't know, I kind of stopped watching Disney movies around this time. I mean, prior to this one came out, I think. But yeah, as you may know, this is a video, of course. <laughs> and guess what? The rest of the stuff featured on the disc are also videos. There's only two playable games and we've done them both. So this video will be nothing but videos. Yeah. This demo video will be nothing... Ooh. Yeah, videos, videos, and more videos. So, seven videos in total of nine featured, uh, you know, nine, there's nine, uh, I don't know, uh, what, what the fuck, uh, what am I talking about? I don't know. Nine <laughs> different things on the demo, and two of them are playable, and the rest are videos. Yeah, that's how simple that was. Yeah, so, we're, uh, one quarter of the way done, Army Man's Sarge's Hero. So let's go. Um, there wasn't really that good of a selection of videos either. It was like mishmash. I just threw some shit together, I guess. Oh, video. Yeah. That's quality right there. Nine. Air Attack 2. Oh, Land, Sea, and Air. Sarge's Hero. Oh, I can select. Oh. I pretty well I don't understand what's so appealing about army men. I mean, why do you want to play as a plastic soldier? Wouldn't you rather play something like that's more realistic? And I mean, there's like I don't know how many army men games like 200 perhaps. I don't know it's crazy. And I honestly do not understand its appeal. I don't think it had any appeal because the games were not that well received, if I recall correct. And I don't know anybody owned these games. I, I, you know, nobody. Okay, that was Air Attack 2, uh, Land, Sea, Air. Okay. Uh, that's land for you. Um. Seriously, this looks this looks so boring. It's crazy. I mean, 
Ah, oh, I get like depressed when watching these kind of games. I really do. I don't know, that's just me. Gabe Newell. No, but seriously, I mean, okay, that was not much sea and not much air there, but land, yeah, sure. Uh, Sarge's Heroes 2. Oh boy, Sarge is here. You bet the fick. Now move it, soldier. Get to the pole, Scorch. Scorch, yeah. Trap isn't there. Table isn't clear. Oh, no, okay. Whoa, yeah, and there we go, that's uh, the last of that. The first triangle, does it exit? Yeah, it does! Sweet! Swills! Uh, that's awesome right there. Okay, so, uh, why? There was like three videos on that one, and... Air attack. Didn't I watch that already? Wasn't that the first? Uh, on that selection screen? Or maybe that was air attack 2 or something. Should have a video for the first one as well. Yeah, 3DO. Mm -hmm. 3DO. Air attack. What's the point of have? Oh my god, why? Okay. Yeah, way to waste space on the disc right there. I mean, see, what? So these are. Ah, uh, fuck it. I don't know if he's even gonna go there. ISS Pro 2, here we go. There's only really three more videos after this one. Yeah, yeah, we'll be done pretty fast. And it's kind of early in the morning right now, so I'm kind of pleased with me not having to, um, you know, play like eight playable demos and embarrass myself like crazy because I'm kind of tired. Um, but I, I, the just thing is I just have to um, be done with these discs, so I have all of them recorded, so I can start editing and stuff. And record Star Fox instead. So I mean, I only have one more disc to record after this one, and then uh, it's it's all good. Oh, this is fun, right? Well, I wonder if I have to like replace some kind of music in this one. Some kind of music, but you know, gun music. I have a feeling I might have to. Would be cool if I didn't have to, but you know, why did he even attempt to? Yeah, I don't know. And why are they only showing like Holland versus France? That's not really fun, is it? Man? Especially if nobody's gonna score any goals here. Uh, it's pretty boring. Oh, really? Probably gonna get a goal there, but no. No, no. No goal. Wow, way to make a football game, you know, uh, video without showing any goals. That's, um, mm, yeah, very special. All right, let's uh, fuck that shit. Uh, we'll go C12, Final Resistance. I've played this on some of the later discs. I don't know which one. Could have been some in the 80s range, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I haven't seen a video for this yet. I don't think I've ever seen a video for it, actually. So that's gonna be pretty cool. Never seen one of those show that, because that's how the back of the cover of the game looks like. Is 
this isn't that bad of a game actually. It's pretty funny. It just feels very advanced for PS1, that's all. So you kinda wanna have like better graphics actually. <laughs> it feels like a like PS2 game, but the graphics like tells you no it's PS1. And I think it was made by the same studio that made Medieval. If I'm not mistaken. And by the way, they should really bring back Medieval. Make a new one. Make it kind of like a God of War game. Um, or something. I don't know, make it as a PlayStation Network title. Just do it. I mean, two games in the and then Medieval Resurrection or PSP, of course, but that doesn't count really. <clears throat> I want a medieval free or something. That would be sweet. I'd buy that. Seriously, I'd do it. Uh, just like I buy a new wipeout, which I'm not thinking I will get, but thank you, Sony, for shutting down Studio Liverpool. Yeah, really appreciate it. Yeah, good stuff. <laughs> if you couldn't tell, I was being sarcastic. Alright, ready to rumble 2, and then we only have first stick, first trick left. Ready to rumble 2. Ready to rumble 2, 2. Okay, let's uh, check this shit out. I know there's a boxing game. I know it's that dude with the afro and has like gloves with a smiley face on that's on fire, I think. Oh no, midway. Oh crap. Then you know it's gonna suck right from the beginning. Afro Thunder, yeah. Maybe his gloves aren't on fire. Maybe that's Prince Nazim or something. Why is the qual? What the? F okay. Why is the quality so low? I mean, the audio is really low, and it's low quality audio, and this is blurry. Whoa. I don't know about these boxing games. I mean, that's... Uh, since I'm not even too keen on regular fighting games, why would I even play a boxing game? I mean, no. No way. I'm not saying the game is bad, it's just not my type of game at all. Whoa. Okay, at least the game, uh, at least the video shows a lot of gameplay, that's pretty good. Um. Okay. Is this done soon or what? I wanna get on with it. I wanna get on with the next demo and I wanna get on with Star Fox. Yay. I don't understand these like realistic, I put that in quotations, but you know, uh, segments of the video, that's pretty weird because it doesn't look real at all. I mean, they tried to go for a real look, but I guess that was like CG or something. No idea. In our live uh, area or like in a green screen that looked real. Because that judge sure looked real, but uh, the rest of the characters, no way. Alright, so that was ready to rumble too. Let's go reverse trick. The last thing on the desk. Yeah, and then there's another video. So imagine having this in your mailbox back in the day. You know, oh wow, two playable demos that both suck ass and then a bunch of videos that suck even worse. Thank you. JVZ. Wakeboarding. Oof, that sure looked nice. Why is the music so low? I don't know. What happens in water? Why is it like red?
the music is really, really low in this part of the video here. It's crazy. Maybe that's very best because it sounds awful. Anyways. A way to sh show gameplay of the game, huh? Even though this looks... Oh, there we go. Speaking of Devil, huh? Uh... What is this, Sonic? Why was the water like green? It looked disgusting. Uh, <laughs> I know what they try to do to reflect like the sunset or something, you know, but th that didn't look like it at all. It just looked awful. This game looks so boring, it's crazy, I have to say. I mean, if I bought this game, I would have been de depressed as hell. Burst trick. Yeah, that was that. Uh, that was the last thing on the disc, and boy, oh boy, does this, does this disc suck ass or what? I can also say this is probably the worst demo disc I ever had the honor of playing. And it's all videos. And it's not videos of good games either, it's videos of crap games you couldn't fit anywhere else. I'm not saying these games are that bad. It's just that, you know, put together with all the rest of this crap, it makes you feel like everything in this disc is shitty ass. You know, anal leakage. Um, yeah, so, this was Euro Demo 69. It was dreadful. Yeah, sorry about that. Uh, hopefully the next week's demo is going to be a lot better, we'll see about that. Uh, we'll find out in a matter of minutes since I'm going to record it ASAP. Alright, so, uh, well, hope you enjoyed this video. As always, stay tuned for all things PlayStation. But for now, peace to you, going offline.